state your business. Reverend Mother Brava expects me. Open the gates! You were good soldiers. Worked hard. Fought hard. <laughs> Drank hard too. Brothers. Sisters. I hope you find peace in these flames. Vigo? What are you doing here? So you lived. I came clean to Prava. About taking that woman's bribe. Ugh, it's looking bad. My ass is on the line. Might not have a job when she's done with me. Hey, you're here for her, right? Let's go together. Maybe she'll go easy on me if you're there. Not many could bear your sins. This is no mere armor. This is a holy vessel of the highest craftsmanship. It may uplift the repentant sinner directly to the light. Can armor do that? Faith rather than flesh moves this suit. Though how is only known to a privileged few. The practice has been long abandoned. Something big is coming. Holy war. Mark my words. She wouldn't have asked me to prepare a relic like this otherwise. Hold. She's expecting us. Here we go. Good luck. Have the new watch commander replace the forces we lost at the mine. So, you've returned. Vigo here tells me you were braver than he. First, you will be made worthy of a blessing. A holy war cannot be won with faithless troops. Make no mistake, this war is holy. Lilith has brought the eternal conflict to sanctuary, and Inarius will deliver us as writ in prophecy. Until then, we have our parts to play. Make a pilgrimage to the Alabaster Monastery. Cleanse your spirit. Then we may discuss a blessing. May as well make myself useful. Come by the ruins, south of here. There's a shrine west of here. There's a relic. I'm told it takes on your sin. 
weighs you down, body and soul, beats the hell out of you. It'll cleanse you, prepare you to stand before the Father. I hope you don't have many regrets, friend. This kind of thing is a lot deadlier for some than others. Watch out, all right? I'll find you at the end. Nothing good. Lost more than a few worthy soldiers to it. But it'll clean you up for Inarius. Rare honor for an outsider. <laughs> if you can call it that. Ah, no. I'm not ready. Not by a long shot. Even if I could survive the trail, there's no telling what would happen in the end. You, though. You have a solid chance. I had my doubts. The priests were always going on about the return of Lilith. But now she's here. Just like they said. of darkness, for you have wandered beyond the reach of the light. Lift your sins, breathe deep the cold air. The path to redemption lies before you, if you have the faith to walk it.
into your bones. Welcome your pain. For the agony of the flesh is the first cleansing of the soul. Make your faith stronger than any hurt. Let the ice into your bones. Welcome your pain. For the agony of the... For he has shown us the way.
Wait a moment. Playing cards doesn't make me a sinner. With that bribe, good soldiers died on account of what I did. Is that the kind of man I am? The kind I'll always be. I just... Damn it. I'm praying. Why isn't this working? Huh, you made it. That makes one of us, at least. You heard from Bravo? I will, soon. But enough about that. You're about to meet Father Inarius himself. Not everyone comes back, you know. You'd better. I, I owe you a stiff drink. Not sure, but I've heard crazy rumors. Daft old monk. If the unlucky bastard still lives, Probably as cold in there as it is out here. It'll be ornate, that's for sure. Only the best for the one at the top. Him. And remember, you are small. Wonderfully small. No, no, no. It's not about kneeling. It's about wonder. Oh, the light itself, divinity itself, radiates from that room. 
Though my flesh is cold and numb, my spirit is warm with reverence. What can we do but kneel? And so he was, until the sweet poetry of the prophecy rang out. To divine its message, he pilgrimaged deep into Sanctuary's heart to meet. Uh, well, I shouldn't say. It pains me to withhold the truth of his light. But I sense it in you, Pilgrim, so I shall tell you. He went to speak with the first of his children, Rathma, the prophecy's true author. He emerged armed with sacred conviction, a holy battle at the center of the prophecy to be won by his blade. He has meditated here for years and years ever since, readying to meet fate head on. How do you know the warmth of the sun, the love of your mother, the beauty of a song? His presence is infectious. It takes hold in the soul. We are a void without faith, an empty well. The pious fill their cups with prayer. Mine overflows with his light. So near, so pure. I am changed. I I am nothing. I am better. Isn't it beautiful? Traverse the Black Lake. 
Sovereign, that cannot be done without your blessing. If I've learned anything during my time here, it is that what we're looking for, and what we need, are rarely the same thing. I once thought I could find an end to this war, but there has been no resolution, only more pain. Everything I've done has pulled me further from home, from the place I need to be. This world we made was born from the impossible, and yet, like its creators, it rots from the inside. I... I don't... Lilith has entered the ancient city. With your blessing, I can pursue her. And this world has been wasted on the crusades of the unworthy. I can stop her. Hmm. This audience is concluded. Blessed are those who bask in the light. Let our faith be our armor against the encroaching darkness. Ah, you've returned. Come, let us speak inside, out of the cold. From the Father's voice to my ears, a spear of light piercing hatred's heart. First Lilith, then the Primes. He will deliver us from the eternal conflict. Vigo and I had a good conversation when he returned. He will do his penance. Trust that he is in good hands. Penitence. In the heavens' eyes, creating humanity was a sin. They cast him down. Now he seeks redemption and the chance to go home. As prophesied, slaying Lilith is that chance. When he ascends, so shall we all. Yet you stand before me unscathed. I know his ways. That is approval enough for me. In the name of the light, I bless you. May the light flow through you and keep you from corruption and sin. Our victory is prophesied in the heavens. An outsider. I could use your help. A dying knight mistook me for his confessor. He spoke of... sacrilegious things. He said his party of knights found a secret to life eternal. A red chalice. Said the bishop leading them ordered them to drink of it. Deep. He confessed they shelter now in a place he called the Sanguine Chapel. The chalice must be retrieved, and I must leave. Find me at the Bear Tribe camp when you have it.
Wait a moment.
ready yet. In the year of the light, 1318, Anno Kejistani, we have buried 92 souls on these hallowed grounds. Abortive and stillborn, seven. Bleeding wounds, four. Childbed, two. Executed, 15. Frostbitten, six. Old age, one. Removal of blood, 54. Starvation, three.
Must wait around.
ready yet. Wait a moment.
Wait a moment. <laughs> that you live I will destroy the chalice and with some luck that will be the end of it thank you for all you've done but please never speak of this again <laughs> <laughs> 